What's good guys, if you guys want the most cheap and most reliable EAFC24 coins, make sure you guys check out u7buy.com on making that team better. Also, if you guys ever want to make a purchase, make sure you guys use the code DAN to get 6% off on making that team better. If you guys ever want to sell your EAFC24 coins, go to the same website and go to the selling section as well. Yo YouTube, what's going on? Welcome to another video to the channel, y'all boys. And today we're gonna go ahead and review 88 rated FC versus Fire Tamori. We're looking at a card 6-1, medium high work rates, three star skill moves, four star weak foot with the right foot. Acceleration type is controlled. Length, the 88 pace, 66 passing, 71 dribbling, 90 defending, 85 physicality, jockey, block on plus, slide tackle, relentless as well with power header now the card is actually looking pretty decent i'm not gonna lie we're gonna go ahead and give him the shadow chemistry stock acceleration goes up to 90 sprint speed gets maxed out stand tackling gets maxed out slide tackling goes up to 98 defensive awareness 94 interceptions goes up to 97 as well 87 strength 86 aggression is a pretty good combination for the card i'm not gonna lie he also has 80 agility 76 balance with that jockey on basic, so I expect this card to feel pretty good defensively whenever we are jockeying. Now, Tamori is going to be playing with this team right here. Shout out to the homie Samoa. We are going to be playing this card in a 4-3-2-1, and he's going to be playing as a right center back right next to that Klaus card. Now, earlier this year, we had a Tamori version. I believe it was the Centurion's version. I could be wrong on which version it was. And he was a pretty good CB, but at this stage of the game, in my opinion, he's a little bit outdated. It's still usable. But not really met. Now we got this 88 Tomori. That's over 1 million coins, guys. I know the promo just started yesterday. But he's over 1 million coins. And team of the year is next week. That's absolutely insane. Because I don't usually not a lot of people talk about Tomori. But he's looking pretty nice. So we're going to play some foot champs games. And see if there's a potential that he's a top 10 CB in the game. We finally got a game. It took a really long time for some reason. Versus Rojas FC. The back line's good. Midfield is pretty meta, and the attack is pretty good. He's doing an Evo. Salmon? Salmon? I don't know. I don't know where her stats are, but. Nice interception from Tamori. Great step. Doesn't win the tackle, unfortunately. He wins it that time. All right, that's a W. That's a W. Great pass as well. Good step. Great step right there. Good tackle right there since Tamori does have block on gold. Good defense. Nice. Good tackle. Got to gets the ball back. All right. Nice. That pace for Tamora being very clutch out, boys. Good goal from Tamora right there. I mean, he was there from the corner, but we do take that to happen. Ooh, what a clean tackle from the boy Tamora, man. That was fire. Way to block that pass, man. Nice. I mean, this pace from Tamori is very, very nice. I'm not going to lie. Good pass. Nice. Good tackle. We are on a yellow, so... We're gonna commit a foul right there. Good tackle, nice and clean. Good tackle. Fire, man. Tamori clamping it up. Great interception. Great pass. 
the tackle nice and clean. Great interception. Tamari, all right, he gets the ball at least. At first, he couldn't really intercept that. Great stuff from Tamori as usual. Let's see, he's gonna catch up to this OBY. He does. Nice. Good composure. Great pass as well. Nice. Once again. Good stuff from Tamori. Great defense, nice. All right, boys, and that concludes the review for 88 rated FC versus Fire Tamori. Coming around 1.4 million coins on the market by the time I'm dropping this video, which is absolutely insane. 805,000 coins on the PC market. We played four games with the card, four wins, and he did have one goal. From a tap in spot now i'm gonna go ahead and say guys that this tamori blew my expectations i'm usually like i said earlier i'm not a tamori fan because of his body type and his animations the centurions was pretty usable pretty good but this tamori is absolutely fire i don't know if they gave him steroids or some shit, but he feels very very aggressive and physical in game his body animations his tackling animations or top tier so obviously pros right off the bat is medium high work rates for those of you guys that believe in work rates pace is exceptional he never gets lby he never gets y ball anytime we're going against a top tier attacker like janola and bopper eusebio tamori is easily able to catch up to the card no matter what attacker it is he also has four star weak foot which in my opinion is another pro for a center back point of view because he does have 82 short pass if you're getting pressed in tight situations Tomori is able to pass it out the back with either foot easily. Another pro from the card is the defensive AI. The defensive AI with this card is absolutely amazing. Going into team of the year with him having 90 defending, 90 defense awareness, 94 stand tackling, 89 interceptions, going up to the high 90s with the shadow chemistry style. He feels top tier, man. Absolutely elite defending from the card. Another pro from the card is the agility and the balance. Great combination with him being 6'1" his body type, and really high defending enables this card to have an insane jockey, guys. He also has jockey on basic, the play style, but his jockeying was absolutely amazing, guys. It reminded me a lot like Militao's jockeying, if not better, because this Tamori, if I'm not mistaken, he has better agility and balance than the Winter Wild Cards Militao. So everything from the card is honestly top tier, obviously. He would have been the perfect CB if his height was like 6'3 or 6'4", but him being 6'1", guys, I'm actually surprised on how good this Tamori is. So in my opinion, by the time I'm dropping this video, it's not Team of the Year yet. Obviously, Team of the Year is next week, so we have to wait the CBs that they're going to drop. But as of right now, this Tamori, if I would have to make a list of the top 10 best CBs in the video game, Tamori would 1,000% be on that list. He is so good, and I guess it kind of makes sense why he's over a million coins, even though that is really expensive. For a CB that's not a team of the year. Um, he's 1,000% top 10. Top 5? He could make the argument. You're going to call me crazy. You guys are going to call me crazy. He could make the argument, man. He's really good. The pace carries him a lot. The agility and balance is really good. Physicality is way better than what it performs. Than what the stats show. You guys let me know what you guys think about this tomorrow. But he's going to get thumbs up for me. And rating wise for the card. He's going to get solid. 9 out of 10. Thank you guys so much for supporting all the videos. You guys are absolutely amazing. The next video that I'm going to be dropping is going to be an FC versus Fire Rudiger. We're going to have to see if that Rudiger is better than this Tamori. Is he worse? Is he a top 10 CV in the game? You know, lots of questions to answer. But thank you guys once again. It's been your boy Dan FIFA and I'm out. Bye-bye.